West West Show. One that I wanted to bring up, um, and look, it's quite a hard one because I don't want us going the way of Six Nations and Super Rugby. But there was there was a couple of incidents that that caused uh, attacking players to ha- go for HIA. Um, so so the first one, Famo Suli. So Famo Suli in the first hit up of that game against the Sharks, he runs it up. Cam McInnes doesn't go low and has a head knock with him. Famo Suli goes down from that. He's out for like five minutes on the ground. Cam McInnes is fine. And he's sent for HIA. Nothing happens to Cam McInnes. So it's like... Oh, what do you think should have happened? At least a penalty. At least a penalty. Just, Just poor technique. Just poor... Wasn't yeah, a hit, hit on head? head, but it's like three people in the tackle. He's coming in late, and he's just no attempt to. He's trying to just put on a shot, but mate, you're like. So do you think? Do you think he's purposely uh, doing a haku? Well, hit I, j- I just think it's it's. Uh, yes, you think it's, it's a, a hit, but it's it's um. Oh wow! Well, well, okay, look. So you think so these guys are? I haven't. I haven't hit looked butts. at the Cam McInnes one very closely. But the other one I wanted to bring up, same situation, Kami Kamika or Kami Tamita on Tohu Harris in the Warriors game. That was definitely like a cannonball hit. A hit his his arms aren't even there. He's not even there. The only thing that's in the tackle is his head. And he just goes diving in and his head is the first thing there. Like, what else do you think you're going to tackle him with, bro? And so... I don't think the judiciary agrees well, with you, bro. Otherwise, you I don't agree with a lot of that the judiciary says. A purpose so, hit, so I beg to differ. I don't even think he was put exactly. on a report. That's my problem with it. My problem with it... <laughs> Are you the only one in the world that thinks well, this is a hit, Mate, if it's a head-on-head clash and Kamitha Mitha is not even close to trying to make that tackle, but he hits him full-on square with his head before the rest of his body gets there in the tackle... Tohu Harris has to go off for 10 minutes. That's a crucial 10 minutes to our attack. Wow. So so you don't think that's like rugby is mm. both codes is, this is capable of uh, any accidental head clashes anymore? Oh, you think look, that accidental, every accidental, tackler, every accidental is accidental. Is, is doing a head but part. when you're like diving but in you don't think they're accidental? How can you be accidental when you're diving in and your body's not even, like, lowered? If if you're, like, coming... He's not a small guy. Maybe if he's, like, hit him and he's, like, low down to the ground, at least five meters, five foot, but he's, like, a six-foot guy and he's hitting Tohu. So what are you saying? Are you, are you saying um, we have to take all low now so that we just give away... Um, You've got to take all low uh, anyway. Uh, the game is tackles. about tackling low. Are we giving away dominant yes, The game's now? about tackling low. Why are these guys trying to hit up people? Like that's my point. So what about what about these tackles if you hit high, but there's no um, head clash accidental? Is that all? Well, when the shoulders hitting them in the face. Anything. If 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 you hit if this is a front on tackle. So so wait wait wait. So you, you tell you me what's the, the difference when there's shoulder on head. That's always every day of the week. That's on report or a penalty. So, of so your shoulders here. So your shoulders here. Week. How the heck is the head on head not the same? Oops. We the, expect them to get their shoulder below that... their head. But if the head hits the head, how the heck is your shoulder not? possibly going to hit the head if you're not even trying to get your head below the head. We expect players to aim low. No, but we expect this players not... to at least get your shoulders below their head. So somehow your head's up at the same level as their head. How is that not the same thing? This, let's, let's, get into, let's get into the okay. uh, sports science here. Break it down for me, mate. So Break it down for me. If you're a tackler, if, if you're a tackler, like Adam Fenor Blake, right? If you're a tackler and you've lined him up, you've lined him up, he's coming, he's, and then he's you right drop. in your path, you get you, you drop, right? But what does Adam Fenor Blake do every time? Fucking late feet. 
and he puts on a late foot, but not quite uh, enough to go uh, to step you. Boom, his head hits your head. Nah, should he be penalised? If should the ball player, player if the ball player drops, because you've only got a split second. Let me finish. Let me finish. You've only got a split second, and all it takes for it doesn't even have to be late feet. It could be uh, one guy. One guy's turning his head this way the, with, with the ball. A guy running with the ball could turn his head this way to kind of brace, and you're already in a position to you're already in a position to tackle. That the heads are gonna meet, bro. Heads are gonna meet. So when you lower your head, that's the thing. That's the first thing that's that's, point that's of contact. Yes, that's making contact. Bro. I agree. I agree. What you're saying is that what you're saying is that the defenders are initiating the head. They are head contact. Are. That's not true. In these bro. instances, it's, they are. What about what about what about the guy running with the ball? Is he not as the guy running with the ball? He's running the ball, so that's what I'm saying. Like, if you got late feet, but when you put your bumpers up, yeah, your head's coming and forward that's as fine. Well. But if the guy, the guy defending, what's the guy know, defending? Why is that fine? Why because is that fine, if though? you're if you're running the ball and you haven't lowered, so I guess it's an it's it's on the attacking player. But if they haven't, it's a case by case. So yeah, it's not a general across the board rule. But if the guy, if the guy is running, sounds like bro. It sounds like every hit on hit contact, you're saying that penalise the defender. Like, come on, who's what are you? Uh, so, 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 so what was different in the Isaac Tungo game bro. that we just saw in about ten minutes ago? Isaac Tungo got put on report for going head on head. I don't know what's the difference. Did did they just listen to us before it happened? Why have they suddenly changed the rules in the third round? Maybe they've realised that. Their rules are shit because they realise it's a case by case, and these refs are getting it wrong. How can how can the attacking player well, this case by get case. ten minutes? Because that's a that's a I disadvantage that. to the attacking team. All of a sudden, the guy that's done a mean ass hit up and he's stayed high, but all of a sudden he's out for ten minutes getting an HIA because this defender hasn't gone low. Like yeah, I understand if you're a attacking player and you do a step and you're coming low. Is that opportunity to get a head knock. Yeah. So that's exactly. a, that's a but if you've coach? stayed high and you're just running yeah. your line and you're doing, like, both incidents, I guess this is my point, both incidents were guys running straight. They weren't trying to, like, go to the player and do some moves. Famo Silly was the first head-up of the game and he's running straight. He put no footwork on. Cam McInnes came in as third man, straight in, head on head. As the third man, how do you come in as third that's man what, head on head? But this one thing, this one thing, right? If if they're both yep. running straight high, right? Why is it on the defender? Because to move he's the defender. Head? Why are you staying straight up? But what well, you can still hit someone high. No way. You Why, Why are you high? trying to hit someone high and, if you're the and, defender? But and not make contact with the head. That yeah. If you execute right, you then you shouldn't be hitting the head. But if you're Kaya and you're, you're like yeah. still standing up straight on a guy who's fucking up the nuts running it straight, why are you up so high? Kamika Mika is coming. He's not a All short guy. Is... And he's still up high. Like he should at least drop. <laughs> if you're trying to drop your shoulder into his chest, but the head, head on head clash, is that not, not an accidental Not if the attacking player has you're trying to... Maybe if the attacking player drops, but if the attacking player is just up the nuts trying to keep straight, puts up his bumper bars, and somehow you get above his bumper bars, that's just. Uh, uh, I think. I think there's um, accidental head clashes, and then there's purposely. And head those butts. are the per- those are what I'm pointing out. The purpose bro. headbutts. Both occasions. Well, I don't think purpose people headbutts. come in. If the defender, if well, okay, ah. then put it this way then. Let's not let's not it's give not them winks, again bro. no it's penalty, winks, no put bro. on report, but at least send both for HIA. Both of them hit each other's head. Why is the defender? Why is the defender? Oh, they should. Why is he all of a sudden? Oh, he doesn't need to go HIA, but the attacker player does. Because it's on the symptoms, bro. If no, well, someone's got a what 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 defender's got a That's better not, head. What the defender's so got a think, stronger head? Do you think every little knock? Everyone's different. Do you think every knock well, has to go off? Play, if it's head on head, what mitigating circumstances does the defender have for him to not need a HIA? What did the bunker see that... Because he stands up. He stands oh. up and carries on. 
so what? These guys are going to have concussion what? issues later in their careers because they're tough and like, oh, I walked, I stood what? up, I stood are you up. For mine now? <laughs> are you for mine now? I'm just are saying, I'm just saying, if this head on head clash, so, somehow the defenders like got a stronger head. Yeah, okay. So, but listen, but listen, but listen. So the guy running with the ball, he gets knocked out. Yep. They both get hit on heads. Obviously, the guy running with the ball, he's injured and he's he's kind of fucking. Well, he could be milking a bit it. Dazed, That's the right? He could be trying to milk a penalty well, like oh, wait, ref. If you're showing, I oh, got someone hit my head. Yeah. I don't know if it was an arm, forearm, or yeah. what. Yeah, and yeah so, well, oh. then you take the chance. You take the chance. You take the chance. But what if what if the tough coconut that's Tried to go in there. Well, how are they determining that? Uh, tackle. Rugby Union. Rugby Union have made have the tackle, mouth but accidentally Rugby Union, headlock. But that's the thing. Accidental headlock. Uh, but does not display symptoms. You well, saying he I don't know. No? I don't want us to Is bring in saying? mouth guards that tell us that. <laughs> but surely the bunker should know. Well, if this guy's been being knocked out, that guy hasn't got headgear. I should send him off too. Well, because oh, there's why? head on head. When he hasn't displayed what symptoms? symptoms. What are symptoms? Bro, these guys got Doc for money. He's looking at them and saying if he's unsteady on you his look feet. At the, but you look I at Tohu Harris. What, 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 what did Tohu Harris do? So he stayed down, we, tried to get a penalty, everyone that didn't down, get a penalty. Everyone. Two minutes later, oh, you got to go HIA. What about the defender? Nothing for Kamiko Mika. See? But obviously Tohu Harris no. was displaying symptoms no for way. him to be asked. Because he field. kept playing How on. do you know? He you made two more hit-ups after that. No impact on the way he was playing, but all of a sudden the bunker goes, oh, you got to come off for 10 minutes. See? That's what's not okay. Yeah. Oh. He obviously what did he saw see? something. He saw an opportunity to disadvantage the Warriors and take him off for 10 minutes, man. We don't know that. But they look at the replay and they assess it. I don't agree. You're saying that any collision with the Ulu, Oh. Everyone's got to get off. You might as well Everyone's off brains the every same. single player. Well, or someone's what got a bit of stronger brain than the next person. No way. If it's a head on, if it's a shoulder Listen, on mate. head, just because Tohu got rid of. But I'm saying, I'm saying, if it's a shoulder, moves, if it's a shoulder on head, on clear. It's clear that the guy defending, he's okay because it was his shoulder on that guy's head. So obviously, the attacking player has to go for HIA. But if it's a head on head. How do those guys have some kind of... They've got no data at all other than, oh, he looks okay. These players will kind of play for their contracts. No, no, you're wrong. The data is assisting... What symptoms? They're the just symptoms. watching what's on field. You get players that carry on playing, yeah. but then like, oh, we're just going to pull you off because we want to do a HIA. Zach Lomax got the same. So it feels like if you milk it, the bunker's going to penalise you for milking it. But the guy who's headbutt you is going to get to play on. So is that right? Is that the risk? Is it, what? Well, good, yeah. Good. What? Yes. If you're going to milk it. Wow. So, so you're now you've gone from symptoms to if, this if is you're real, milking it, you get you get sent off. You get penalised. But how can we judge? Exactly. How can, how can we, we judge? judge you just told me that there's symptoms and some analysis that they do, but now you're swept to on oh, that. It's just... Yeah. But if, you, if you're willing to milk it, if you're willing to milk it, and the four mighty thinks oh. that that's the symptoms, oh, well, I digress. So I digress. Well, Let's move on. In the first place? Let's move on to something more interesting, because... He's lost, bro. Not because of, not because of the HIA. He's just <laughs> hey, lost. I'm just trying to prove a point that these guys aren't being consistent <laughs> with their way of assessing. There's going to be a lot of guys with concussions because they're trying to be tough, and I don't like it. Anyway, 